You see, every day that you wake up and you put things into the human body, everything, it's amino acid, a mineral, a vitamin, a nutrient, nothing that you put into your body is used in the format that you put it in. Your body goes through a process called methylation. It changes what you put in into the usable form. If your body cannot perform this function, then it's as if that nutrient doesn't exist. So for example, we pull crude oil out of the ground, but you can't put crude oil in your gas tank. Your car doesn't understand crude oil. It has to be refined into gasoline, and that fuel source goes into the car. In human beings, this process is called methylation. And so what happens is you put things into the human body, your body methylates them, and then it uses it. If it cannot methylate, it cannot use that source. And what happens is the presence of pathology and disease. Okay, that, that's not true for all things that go into your body. Methylation, when talked about from a scientific perspective, is actually usually putting a methyl group at a location on DNA. And what that does is it usually turns off or on specific genes. So if something's more methylated, that gene may be more expressed. Eating a steak does not always mean that the amino acids need to be methylated to be used by the body. That's not how methylation works.